Welcome back to the Boo Review. We're here with some new information on a story that made a splash back in August, and we want to set the record straight on it. We're going through suggestions, and this one here is from Jariah Gaming. I'm going to hand this one over to Jared because he's been talking to an inside source that's provided us with lots of valuable information. So, Jared, take it away. In North Carolina, around an apartment complex, there were some stories going around that somebody was leaving meat around in a playground, apparently to poison dogs in the area. Someone took these photos and attributed the meat action with the hooded figure despite the person not actually holding any meat in their hands. As I was watching the original video, I noticed someone in the YouTube section saying they knew who the person was, so I asked them about it. Jamie Ramos gave us not only the whole story, but also some proof to go along with it. So basically, Jamie is the one walking outside in her mom's complex with her niece, who's taking pictures of her in this snazzy looking cloak, just all in good fun. Whenever she got to this spot here between the two apartment locations, a neighbor from the first floor to the left of her took these photos, and for some reason assumed that because she was wearing a cloak, that must mean she also likes to leave meat in playgrounds. We all know that cloaked figures are up to no <laughs> good, right? If, you, if you've got a cloak on, you're, you're clearly out to poison the animals, to poison the youth, to poison their minds, most of all. <laughs> also, if you look at the pattern on the cloak in these images, you can see that's the same pattern on the pictures that went viral. So this is the same girl. So the neighbor uploaded these pictures and we're guessing also started the rumors about the meat. We can't find any news about meat being left in the playground other than the one associated with Jamie's pictures here. So we're assuming the meat story is probably not even true. If there was meat left in the playground is completely unrelated. I guess this just all plays into what Americans fear the most. People in hoods, and more importantly, meat that cannot be eaten. Speaking of being afraid to eat meat, that's how uh, Siddhartha Gautama died. Who? Like the Buddha. Oh. He ate some rancid meat. It was offered to him as a gift. He had to eat it. And he knew it was bad. The lesson here is to be more like the Buddha and just eat the meat that people leave <laughs> in playgrounds. <laughs> if you see meat in the playground, eat that sucker. Most news sources claimed that it was a college student doing it for a school project. Though Jamie is a college student, this was all and fun and not in any way associated with anything from school. There were other sources saying that it was some guy named Nate Holt who was filming for a YouTube channel called Walking the Plains about the card game Magic the Gathering. We're glad Jamie gave us her info when she did as it would have been pretty hard going through all his videos just to find when he was in North Carolina. Battle for Innistrad. In there? Is there also a restroom in there? Zero out of seven out of principle because these photos and these reports are all based on rumors and fear mongering. It's a zero out of seven on the principle that the story blown out of proportion and out of context mm -hmm. really could have had a negative impact on someone's life, if it, especially mm -hmm. if it's a small town where everyone knows everyone. Huge thanks to Jamie for providing us with this information. Thank you so much for trusting us with all this information and hopefully this reaches some people and really clears things up. All right, and that's the first of our suggestions that we covered. We were working on a list. This one made it out as an individual because we learned so much information on it. In the meantime, we are working on the rest of the suggestions and they'll be coming out periodically. So thank you so much for sending those. Send any others. If you watch our channel, if you send us suggestions, you kind of know our style. So never be offended if we're harsh on anything. Right, yeah, yeah. Because if it seems like we're overly harsh, we're probably just doing it to have fun with it. So don't take it to heart. That being said, look forward to future suggestions. Basically, AJ saying, F your suggestions. <laughs> no, I That's what you're saying right now. No. See, I would never say anything like that. I love your suggestions. All your suggestions have been very entertaining. I was I was gonna say, I've loved watching all of them. He's lying, he just said y'all. No, I've enjoyed watching all of them. But again, thank you all for watching. Look forward to those suggestions. In the meantime, check out a couple of the past videos covering top 10 ghosts. We got the new paranormal and weird stuff from October that we uploaded. Top 50 horror movies of all time, all kinds of great stuff. So if you're new, plenty of stuff to check out there. And in the meantime, if you enjoyed, like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you again soon. Thank you for watching and peace.